Okay, out doing a little day trip in the woods by our house with Derek. We've been uh, doing some airsofting out here in the woods, so just some little hardwoods forest, you know, off and away. And uh, gonna make a little ramen noodles there. So I got my Trangia and my uh, Glacier stainless steel cup. So there's a Trangia, some hardware cloth, uh, just a little piece of aluminum flashing for a windscreen. Uh, you know, the Trangia keeps three ounces of fuel in it, so we got the lid to the pot, uh, put this all together in a rush. All the pot stand and wind cloth and all that fits in this little you know, piece of cardboard, so I keep it for my pack. Put the trangy in this plastic bag. Glacier cup goes on the bottom of my uh, guillot bottle. You'll have to excuse all the bouncing around here. So there's the guillot bottle, glacier bottle, or the glacier cup goes in the bottom of there. Uh, so that's a quart of water, plus I got my uh, pint of water here in this flask. That's a plastic flask. I could theoretically use the geo bottle to boil water if I wanted. So we're out here. Uh, some of the other kit is just a little uh, 30 liter day pack there. And uh, got some paracord, uh, video camera, some compressed gauze with uh, just neosporin and duct tape, so that's my improvised bandage. Uh, extra batteries, some more batteries for my Phoenix LD20. Some coffee, I'll have a little coffee here. Uh, my Gorilla Pod that I'm not using. My little PSK with uh, the Turley uh, PSK knife and some honing compound. This little survival fishing kit here that I did a review on. There's no place to fish around here, but it'd be pretty cool if there was. My MP3 player in there uh, and charger. So a little entertainment. Got the scope here for uh, Derek's airsoft gun. We're just out here airsofting. Got a couple of light books, Trees of North America and Knots for Climbers. So if I want to practice some knots. Got my uh, uh, 5x7 emergency blanket here, the heavy duty kind, the trauma blanket kind. Got my little silk liner if I don't you know, get a little chilly. Binoculars. Uh, some apples and oranges over there. And that's it. And just the clothes on my back. So peace. really not much. Derek says peace. Give the peace sign, Derek. Peace. It's copyrighted. Peace, peace is copyrighted, not by us. Okay. Right, so there's the Trangia, and there's my coffee going for the uh, Starbucks Via, right? One of the things, if you just can use one cup, like, like the Glacier stainless steel cup, and doing ultra minimalist, you have to be organized. So I made some ramen noodles, and when I got done with the ramen noodles, I put them in that uh, tin can there that I had peaches in. Again, this is just the day trip. Don't forget to bring a spoon or a fork. So I got a uh, Lexan spork there from REI. The thing I like about that, you can't seem to say this is silly. It's a buck ninety-nine, I think, but it's got a nice deep bowl. It's got the spork, which is what I like, and it's light, you know, it's heat resistant. Of course, over an open fire, it's not going to do that. But the titanium sporks, I have one of those, they taste too much like metal. Can't stand that. I do like the, you know, it's in your mouth and it tastes like you're chewing on aluminum foil. Mm -hmm. So the REI titanium spoon, I really don't care for. So these REI uh, Lexan sporks, I really do like. So again, that's, after I cooked it up, I put the uh, ramen noodles in there. And I put my coffee in here for my via, and I had an apple and an orange, and uh, you know, just a little power bar. And we're just out here doing a little day trip. Air and doing a little airsofting in the woods. Peace.